Like, as soon as you step out with this shirt on, everyone is going to be looking at you. Hey guys, it's your girl Benny by J, and I'm wondering what's popping? Cause I know you popping. As you can tell by the title, I am doing a Shein haul, okay? And not only just a regular, regular Shein haul, it's for the summer, okay? It's hot outside, hotter than normal, okay? I'm sorry, climate change, like, they don't believe in you, but I do. And if you like anything you see in this video, use the code Jaden for 15% off because you gotta save the coin. Before we get to this video, I wanna tell y'all a way to protect yourselves on the internet. Do you know what the fastest growing crime in America is? For years, this crime's rate has been surging and affecting millions of Americans. I'm most definitely talking about identity theft. And if you didn't know, there's a new victim every 14 seconds. Yet despite this, those who have had their identity stolen are often shocked when it happens. Imagine trying to log into your email account and finding out that your password was changed literally hours ago. Then you start getting notifications of activity from your bank, your credit cards, and your crypto accounts. And that's when the feelings of panic, fear, anxiety, paranoia, disbelief, and guilt set in. That's why I'm excited to partner with Aura, who is sponsoring this video. Aura is identity theft protection, fraud monitoring, a, a VPN, password management, and antivirus software all combined into one app. Mind y'all is easy to use. This is how Aura looks on desktop. You can access the pricing, frequently asked questions, and features through the app. Access how to learn about protecting your personal information with just a few short clicks, where Aura helps you find the best protection for your account. Aura helps users protect themselves from credit fraud. They also help track your bank accounts to put a stop to any suspicious activity. With Aura, you can protect yourself and your family from financial loss, reduce spam calls, dangerous sites, and consult with a specialist in recovering your identity if you've been a victim of fraud. Aura also protects your online accounts and helps secure your devices from malware, viruses, and hackers. Aura monitors the dark web for your emails, passwords, and social security numbers and send alerts fast right to your phone and or email. When it comes to fraud, every single second matters. Connect your credit and bank accounts and get notified of any changes four times faster than Aura's competitors. Their VPN allows you to stay anonymous online by keeping your browsing history and personal information safe and encrypted. And their antivirus software will block malware and viruses before they affect any of your devices. Now let's get into how Aura has impacted me personally. When I put all of my personal information in, I see that I received 17 alerts for my information being shown on the dark web. After signing up, leave a comment below with how many times your personal information was found on the dark web. Aura will help protect you and your family from America's fastest growing crime. Try Aura free for two weeks and see if you or any of your family's personal information has been compromised. This is the link to try Aura for 14 days free, but I will also have it easily accessible in the description below. So make sure y'all go to my description to get your 14 days free to keep you safe. And I don't know if you know this, but Shein also had a security breach in 2018. And within this breach, they were able to access the emails and encrypted passwords of 6.42 million customers. And this just goes to show that our information is not always safe with our favorite companies to shop at. So Aura will give you the chance to protect yourself in case anything like this ever happens again. Woo, that was a lot to get out. A lot of information for y'all to take in. But other than that, I don't wanna keep y'all waiting for too long. Let's get straight into the video. This is the first shirt that I have to show y'all. And I got this shirt in the size, I got this shirt in the size 1X. And let me tell y'all why I like this shirt. I don't know, I feel like this shirt just gives me like mummy vibes. Like, I wanna see if y'all can like see like the fabric, I don't know. It just giving mummy vibes, like, and I like that. I don't know. I don't know why I like that, but I just like that it was different, so I decided to get it, okay? <laughs> 
That's it, that's all. I decided to get it because it looked different. This is how it looks from the front. And this is how it looks from the back. It is very much so cute. Like I like it a lot, a lot. Like it just looks good, okay? I would say it's true to size, so don't go up, go down. Okay, so this next top, I really like this next top just because it gives bougie. I don't know. I feel like it just looks very luxurious to me. Okay, so this top I got in a size 1X. And I really like this because it just gives off looks. Like I feel like a bag of money right now. Like I look expensive. You know, like this top gives luxury vibes. I was like, I gotta get it. I gotta get it. I'm not me if I'm not looking just a little bougie, okay? Just a little bit. But this is how it looks. I hope y'all can like really see it. I had to tuck my bra because I did not feel like taking it off. I'm sorry. I had to tuck it. But this is what it looks like up close. Hold on. But this is what it looks like up close. This is how it looks from the front. And this is how it looks from the back. Like most of my back is covered. Like a good amount of baggage is covered. I feel like when I wear this, I gotta be going out somewhere nice, okay? Somewhere expensive. I got this in a size 1X. I would say it's true to size. So don't go up or don't go down. Now I'm see y'all the next day. Okay, so this is the next top I got. And I got this top just because I just feel like it's like a casual top that you can literally wear everywhere. Like you can dress it up, you can dress it down. And I need to have the options to dress up or dress something down, okay? Cause when I'm going out, I'm the most pickiest person ever. Okay, ever. <laughs> I got this in a size 1X and I would say it's true to size. And this is how it looks from the front. And this is how it looks from the back. And this is how it looks up close, like I wanna, get y'all to see the color like I don't know I feel like it's giving off like a, a orange like tell me if you see like it's this is like a deep red like a vibrant red and I don't know if it's giving that or not I hope it is you can pair this with a nice pair of like flare out jeans like not flare out but like what do you call it when the end like wide leg wide leg flare out wide leg Back to the shirt, so I got this in red and I also got it in like a, a lime, like a, I don't know what kind. I don't know what kind of green this would be, but I also got it in this color. I think it's a vibe, okay? I thought I'd get both so I could have both options for it. If I want to wear red and do something bold or wear something like more neutral like this. And I both I got them both in the size 1X, so I don't want to try both on, but I did want to show that I did get I would give this top a cool, it's not anything spectacular, so I can't even really rate it crazily. Like, it's just a basic old top that I really like and enjoy, so. It's cute, so I guess I would give it a 10 out of 10, but it's pretty simple, so I don't think it's even that serious. Other than that, make sure y'all get your regular size. Don't go up and don't go down. Now this shirt is the last shirt I have to show y'all, but I just wanted to save the best for me, okay? Cause ain't no way. I was leaving this shirt on the website. I seen it and I snatched it up. Now, the whole tie-in thing, I had to leave it up to the Lord himself because I was struggling. Okay, like I've been over here trying to tie this shirt the way it looks on the website for like 15 minutes. I had to hang it up. I had to hang it up. I had to give it up because there was no way I was gonna make it happen. I'm sorry. Just know I did try, but it did not work out. <laughs> but anywho, I got this shirt in the size 0XL because they were out of 1XL, but it kind of still worked out nice because I feel like it's just like one of those shirts you tie up, so it's not that serious, but this is how it looks up close. I could not get these things right, so but just know that I did try, but this is what it looks like up close. This is what it looks like from the front, and this is what it looks like from the back. It covers most of my back, so I do like that about this too, but yeah. I most definitely like this shirt. If you get anything from this haul, make sure this shirt is on the list, please. Cause you're going to look bomb in it. Like if you get this shirt, you gonna look 30 times better than me, okay? Cause you don't know how to tie it. I didn't give too many ratings today, but this gets a 10 out of 10 for me. Like 
I look good. Like as soon as you step out with this shirt on, everyone is going to be looking at you. They're gonna be hating, they're gonna be wanting you, they're gonna wanna be your friend. And you know I usually don't like the floral stuff. Like I don't like it, okay? But this just gives me renaissance, you know? It gives me renaissance. I might be lying about the time period, but that's just what's popped up in my head, okay? That's what pops up in my head. <laughs> but anywho, I got this in a size. 0XL and I will say it's true to size because this is a little snug okay so make sure y'all get your regular size so you're not struggling like me because I don't even know how I'm going to get this off I, I really don't so just pray for me because I really don't know how I'm going to get this off so the next thing that I have to show y'all are these pants and let's, let's get into it so this is what the pants are giving like it's have like this little flare thing at the end I mean it flares out at the end and it has these strings. And I'm gonna tell y'all right now, I do not like the strings at all. Like I hate them. These strings are really ugly and it's too long. I just don't like that. I don't like that at all. But this is how the pants are looking. I just don't like the little string parts on the side. I hate them. If I was going to wear these, I would honestly cut the strings off just because it looks crazy. It looks crazy with it. I do not like it at all. And I don't even have too much to say about this because I just want to get these off. Like, it's not cute. It's messing up my mood. So I just want to take them off. But I'm going to give it a cool... It's not bad. So I'm going to give it like a 6, 7 out of 10, okay? Just because I'm just not feeling the strings. They're way too long. It should have made them at least a little bit shorter. Well, a lot shorter because it's just way too long. You're going to drag the strings, okay? And that just doesn't add up to me. So 6, 7 out of 10. And I'm just over it, okay? Like... This skirt is the next thing. It's like a skirt actually, because it's like shorts, but it just is made to look like a skirt. But it's like a skirt, okay? Just, let's just go with that. It's a skirt. This is that skirt. It, I got it in the size one X, and I think I look really good, okay? Like I'm not really, I'm not a big skirt person or anything similar to a skirt. Just because I be like, look at that hot mess. Like, what is it giving? Like that, that just runs through my mind every time I try to wear something like this. But right now, I think this is really cute, okay? Y'all tell me what y'all think in the comments. But right now, I feel like it looks good on me, okay? This is how it looks from the front. And this is how it looks from the back. Yeah, the case is not kicking I got this in a size on X, and I think it's really cute. I think it's really cute on me. Like right now, I think I might be a little bit delusional, but I really do think it's cute. So I would give this a 10 out of 10. But let me know in the comments if y'all think differently. If y'all think like, girl, I don't know if that's cute. I don't know if that was good. Let me know y'all opinion. Don't do too much because I do read these comments and I don't want to cry myself to sleep. But give me y'all honest opinion because I want to know how y'all think. And I think this is cute. And I would say shoot a size, so get your regular size. Don't go up. Don't go down. These shorts, you can't really even see the shorts, but I'm going to try to put a picture up. It comes in white, brown, and black. And these are the black ones. I do really like these shorts. I give all of these shorts a 10 out of 10. Like, and I love that it came in three. Good things come in threes. Sometimes. Sometimes. I really like these shorts and I don't have anything too crazy to say about it, but this is how it looks from the front. This is how it looks from the back. I'm gonna show y'all the other ones. I ain't trying them on, but I'll show y'all. So this is how the white pair looks. This is the front of the white pair. This is the back of the white pair. I have wore this before and I got these in a size 1X. <clears throat> and these are the brown ones. I have not worn these yet just because I don't have a lot of brown in my closet. But I will plan on, I do plan on wearing these. It's just, I, I gotta find something good with it. But this is how it looks. And they're just some simple shorts. Like you can tie this up with like, a top like this you know you can dress these up or you can wear like a, a graphic tee like when I wore it I wore graphic tees with all these shorts when I was when I was on my vacation so I got these for like streetwear purposes but you can dress this up however you want to dress them up I will say it to the side so get your regular size then go up and don't go down and get y'all some shorts okay because you could just throw these with anything especially a graphic tee okay it gives the streetwear okay Okay, so these shorts are some boy shirts I got, and this came in four. You have 
black, a light brown, a dark brown, and a white. These are the black shorts that I have, and they are cute. Like, and I think my butt look a little bit good in it. It's not like, you know, big, but it's not non-existent either, okay? It's not. But I really like these shorts, just because they're not too short, where it's just gonna keep, like, rising up my thighs, but they're not too long, where it just looks really tacky. So that's why I really like these, and I think I look good in them. I think I look good. This is how it looks from the front. This is how it looks from the back. These highlights are heavy. <laughs> so this is the white pair. This is the white pair. This is the front. This is the back. It's pretty simple and cute. I just like simple stuff. Like you don't have to do too much all the time when you get simple stuff. But this is like the light brown. Yeah, this is the light brown. Front in the back this is the darker brown the front in the back and I, and mind y'all i got this all in a 1x and i would say it's true to size so it'll go up and go down and i would use a 10 out of 10 because i really really like this like i think i look bomb diggity right now can't nobody tell me different and so that's what i'm gonna just continue to go with <laughs> but yeah i could use a 10 out of 10 i really like them if you plan on getting dressed up for the summer boy shorts is a must you can't survive a summer without any kind of boy shorts. I thought I would be able to show y'all these because they're cute as hell. But I got the wrong size. I got a zero XL. Who told me I could fit a zero XL? In jeans? This dress is the next thing I have to show y'all and I got this dress in a size large, okay? So I stole it from the skinny girl section but this outfit is very, very stretchy. The spaghetti strap dress that comes so you can put under this. It looks really nice. And this goes all the way down to my ankles. I will pan the camera down. Okay, so this is what the dress is giving. I think it looks really, really, really good. Like, let's just get into it. Like, it just looks really good. Like, and I know this is supposed to be like a summer haul, but this is not too bad for the summer. Just because it's super, super see-through. You can't go wrong with this. Like, it looks really good. This is how it looks up close. This is how it looks for the back. Ah, I can't, I can't. I look too good. Like, I just look too good. I'm just looking at myself and it's just like, who created you, okay? Like, how do you look so good? Like, oh my gosh, this looks so good. And if I had the waist trainer on, whoo, I would be snatching lines right now. Snatching lines, that's how good this looks, okay? That's exactly how good this looks. This has to be like one of the favorite things that I've gotten in this whole haul, just because it looks so good. Like this is another thing that I really recommend you get. I'll give this a 10 out of 10. And I need Shein to start putting more stuff like this in the plus size section. Cause the fact that it's only in the straight section, we feel disrespected. I'm speaking for the people that's plus size watching this video, but we most definitely feel disrespected that we ain't got more cute options, okay? We're not trying to be outside looking like somebody granny, okay? We trying to step up and step out when we go outside, okay? So I'm gonna need you, she, you, to get it together, like. Okay, so this is the next thing that I want to show y'all. And I got this dress in a size 1X, and I would say it's true to size, so remember that. But I decided to get this dress just because it's a basic black dress, and you really can dress this up any way that you want to. I do like these two little small slits. It doesn't do too much. It doesn't look too grown, but I am grown. But you know, for the people that don't want to do too high of a slit, this is for you. I wish I would have put my bright and brown on in that freaking waist trainer, okay? Cause I would be snatched right now, snatched. But this is how it looks up close. I hope y'all can see like the fabric. But anywho, this is just a basic black dress. There's nothing too much to say about it but I really do like it. The straps are adjustable, so it's not just falling off you. You can tighten them. I think I lied. I would give this a seven out of 10. Like, I think this hat is literally so freaking cute. Like, come on. Ugh, I cannot wait. I don't know what I will wear with this. I do have an idea, but it's not fully formed, but I had to get it just because it is really cute. Like, I wish the ends were like a little bit more bumped up, but other than that, I'm gonna give this a 10 out of 10. It's really cute and unique. I really like this, it's really cute. I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. Okay, so I'm gonna show y'all this one first because one of the earrings fell on the floor and I did not feel like picking it up. But this is how this one looks. 
These are like earrings that I really thought were really cute. So I decided to get them. And the, this one and the next ones I'm about to show y'all, it came together, okay? They're not like separate. So yeah, this is what these look like. And then these are what the other ones look like. I just thought they were really cute. They're different. And I feel like it just gives off like, I don't know. They're just unique. Like I feel like I haven't seen anyone with these on. So I was like, why not get them in their gold? And I love me some gold, y'all. I love me some gold. And these both get 10s out of 10s. So these are the second batch of jewelry I got. And the, these ones and the next ones I'm about to show y'all, they also came as a duo. But y'all, let's really get into these. Like these are really, really cute. Like, oh my. I love the green and the browns and the golds and the pearls. Like. They did what they needed to do with these, okay? These are the other ones from the do I just shown y'all. And I really like these just because I was the gold. And this green is just so cute. Like, I think that's my favorite part about this is that that green. This green right here, it just gives what it needed to give. Like, it just adds too much flavor, okay? Too much flavor. I love it. I love it. I will also give those... I will also give that a 10 out of 10. Like it just, it just did what needed to be done. Overall, for this to be my coming back Shein video, we did good, okay? I feel like the stuff that I got were good. Enough to set you up until the next haul, okay? Where I step up and step out. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And make sure you like, comment, and subscribe cause you know the vibes. And if you liked anything you've seen in this video, use the code Jaden for 15% off. And I'm gonna see you guys next time. Bye.